USA Point After. I'm Megan Clemente. Sunday featured a full slate of Conference USA games, and we start things off with Houston versus Rice. Houston entered Tudor Fieldhouse, hoping to end their four-game losing streak, and Rice looked to keep the positive momentum going from their 61-53 victory over UAB. In the first half, Rice junior Jessica Custer was on fire, scored 14 points and pulled down nine rebounds in the half. The Owls would enter halftime up 31 to 24. Second half, Crystal Porter gets the ball in the lane and gets her turnaround day to fall. The Rice lead extends to 14. Soon after, Porsche Landry and the Cougars reverse the course of the game. Houston with the chance to tie with two minutes left in the half. Landry hits the three and it's all knotted up at 51 apiece. Cougar freshman Marche Amerson gets the rock. She's met by Custer on her way to the basket, but her shot is good and Houston wins this one 53-51. The Cougars finish the game with a 24-8 run to get the victory. Landry finished the game with 17 points, 4 boards and 5 assists. UCF completed the season sweep over Memphis with the 83-62 win. Freshman guard Brianna Jackson put up her sixth 20-point performance, and it was also her second double-double of the year with a game-high 29 points, 11 rebounds. Plus, she added seven steals to her already impressive performance. UAB defeats East Carolina 62-58 behind stellar play from UAB junior Ashley Grimes. She scored a career-high 31 points, pulled down six rebounds, and dished out two assists. The Blazers snap a three-game losing streak with the win, and it was the first Pirate loss in five games. Tulsa welcomed Tulane to the Donald W. Reynolds Center by jumping out to a 10-0 lead early in the first half. The Green Wave would go on a run of their own, scoring 15 straight points to take a 19-18 lead. Danielle Blagg attempts a three. She misses, but Whitney Bibbins is there for the putback. The Golden Hurricane enters halftime up 35-29. Second half, it was a back and forth and fair until. You're Tulsa, you've got to get a good shot. Mayberry counted. Talia Mayberry goes to the line. Tulsa goes on a win 67 to 65. Talia Mayberry finished with a game high 24 points, two rebounds, and four assists. She's now also number two on Tulsa's all time scoring list. SME junior Kenna May scored 17 points, going 4 for 8 from beyond the arc in the 67-50 victory over Marshall. It was the Mustangs' 10th straight victory, second longest streak in program history. SMU remains unbeaten in league play, improving to 9-0 with the W. UTEP's Annette Steinberger imposed her will on Southern Miss as she produced her fifth double-double of the season. She scored 17 points while registering 16 boards and UTEP's 60-55 win. Her teammate Kayla Thornton also had a solid game, scoring 14 points and pulling down 11 boards. The women return to action on Thursday and we'll be back on Friday with your results. Thanks for watching this edition of CUSA Point After.